Come, Altair. Speak with me a moment. As you wish. Word has reached me of your success. You have my gratitude and that of the realm. Freeing these cities from their corrupt leaders will no doubt promote the cause of peace. Can you really be so sure? The means by which men rule are reflected in their people. As you cleanse the cities of corruption, you heal the hearts and minds of those who live within. Our enemies would disagree. What do you mean? Each man I've slain has confessed strange words to me. They are without regret. Even in death they seem confident of their success. Though they do not admit it directly, there is a tie that binds them. I'm sure of it. There is a difference, Altair, between what we are told to be true and what we see to be true. Most men do not bother to make the distinction. It is simpler that way. But as an assassin, it is your nature to notice, to question. Then what is it that connects these men? Ah, but as an assassin, it is also your duty to still these thoughts and trust in your master. For there can be no true peace without order, and order requires authority. You speak in circles, master. You commend me for being aware, then ask me not to be. Which is it? The question will be answered when you no longer need to ask it. I assume you called me here for more than just a lecture. <laughs> Very well. A rank and weapon are again restored to you. Two more leaders remain. Go and see to it that their rule is ended. Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield the blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. You must be busy. I understand. You must be busy. I understand. He's going to run into someone. Use the scholars you have rescued to pass unknown. Forbidden for you to be here. Not allowed. 
They let you come and go as you please. I thought the fortress was closed to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I've finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way, and not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't, actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says quite the opposite, in fact. Many passages of being patient and faithful and waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. Well, I say we've waited long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off then. Ta Mm-hmm. 
It's forbidden for You're you to be You're not supposed here. to be here. Leave. You have no business here. Leave. You're somewhere you shouldn't be. Leave me alone! You're not supposed You're to be somewhere here. You shouldn't be. Leave. Leave before you get hurt. This is actually quite amusing. <laughs> Don't hurt me, please! Oh, I hear down! And we engage him, but the other tries to embrace. What good could come of this when a king cannot decide what he truly wants? But William knows. If you would only listen. Stand up, friends. Do not allow yourselves to be sent to slaughter based on the whims and wishes of an uncertain king. We must rely on men who are stronger in their convictions. Men like William of Montferrat. Of you. 
Stop. Uh, enough. Enough. What is it you want? Gold? I have a few pieces on me. Take them. Take them and go. It's not gold I seek, but information. I know nothing. You know William. Tell me how to reach him. It's impossible. He meets at the King. And when will the King be gone? Today. But it won't help you. They're sure to argue. And then William will retire to lecture the soldiers. So it always goes. Richard berates William. William berates his men. He won't see you. I already told you. I need to see William. I never said he needs to see me. Then our business is done. Not yet, I'm afraid. There's one last thing I need from you. What is it? Your life. <laughs> Not allowed to be forbidden for you to be here. Turned away from God. I need food. I'm so hungry. 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 I'm so hungry.
not afraid. Fear and doubt are the weapons of our enemies. What's that? Do not listen to their lies. Poisonous words of the No business here. Leave. This will teach you not to steal. Won't be anyway. Come on. I'll fight you down. Not trespass here. Come no further. You 
You've no reason to be here. Leave now. Supposed to be here. Il y a un assassin dans les parages. Keep down, Bird, mit dem Tod der Bestra. Liebe gehören gehängt. Rodoha, alle. I'll cut you down. has spread of your deeds, Altair. It seems you are sincere in your desire to redeem yourself. I do what I can. And sometimes you do it well. I assume it is work that reunites us? Yes. William of Montferrat is my target. I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. I know what I must do to reach him. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large and many men call him master. But he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. Don't do that again! Be gone, beggar. <laughs> Why must 
Rest now. Your schemes are at an end. What do you know of my work? I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Akka for your son Conrad. <laughs> for Conrad? My son is an arse, unfit to lead his host, let alone a kingdom. And Richard, the Oncino is no better, blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial. Akka does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy, forced them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You who speak of good intentions. News. William of Montferrat is dead, and with him his plans for betrayal. You've done well keeping Akka from his hands. But why now, when the Crusaders require unity most? You could have waited. Waited for what? For Richard to return and discover his schemes? No. It was the perfect time for him to strike. Strange. I was sure he meant to take Akka for Conrad, yet he claimed this was not his plan. You cannot trust the words of a snake, which even in death produces venom. I should discuss this with al Muallim. Yes, my friend. Make haste for Masiyah. I am sure he is eager for news. Fast 
forwarding memory to a more recent one.